What's going on, everybody? We got a new game on the channel, Snow Runner. Finally got this game. I've been eyeing it for a minute. Seen a lot of dudes playing it on YouTube, and I was like, yo, let me give this a shot, man. This is like a lot of fun. So the premise of this game is what you see here, man. A lot of off-roading, a lot of getting stuck in the mud using, using a winch, different kinds of trucks. You know what I'm saying? There's missions where you got to move material. And I think this first mission we're doing here, uh, I have to go find the watchtower. And as you can see, I'm getting stuck here. I got to get into all-wheel drive. <laughs> this, this is pretty... Oh, I'm turning sideways. Uh, kicking up a lot, of, a lot of mud. So we got to go to a watchtower, which uh, when you get to the watchtower, it opens up more of the map. Um, and then from there we could uh, pick our first mission and I'm stuck here. I guess I gotta hit reverse. I'm getting it, I'm trying to learn the, uh, the controls here. I'm using the, the Logitech steering wheel, but then you also utilize the mouse and a lot of the buttons on the steering wheel. Uh, once you plug in, the, oh, I'm stuck. And I, I'm surprised I didn't knock down, knock down the sign. Um, once you plug in the steering wheel, the the button, a lot of the buttons are mapped in the uh, in the game, so you don't have to do much as far as mapping buttons or anything like that. A lot of it's pretty much set for you. So we're gonna head down this hill. The watchtower is not too far off. Almost took at that pole. Oh! And yes, you can overturn. You can knock. If you're, you're a truck carrying a load, you can knock it off and pretty much end the mission. I gotta admit that the, uh, the visuals in this game are incredible. Incredible. And I'm playing in 2K. I can only imagine how it looks in 4K. This way here, I gotta get to that watchtower. Now in the game you see in the bottom left corner is the fuel. Uh, you have to fill up a lot. The good thing about it is that it's free. Honking the horn there, <laughs> press the wrong button. Um, and here's the, uh, in, in, in the, in the, uh, in the truck. I gotta admit that it's pretty detailed. I dig the hands, uh, the movement. So, uh, so the fuel, uh, it is free. You just got to stop at a fueling station, fill up, and just make sure you. Got a little warning. A lot of tutorials come up in the beginning of the game, so you have to make sure that you fill up constantly. You don't want to get caught out there with no fuel, because then you pretty much have to end the game uh, and start over, or yeah, you're pretty much screwed. And I'm not going to do that because there's no road there, so I'm just going to go this way here. And I noticed that the key of the of the game is to try to drive not in the middle of, of the road, but off to the sides where. Oh, just took over that! I can't believe I didn't lose my transmission over that rock. Uh, the key is to stay on the try to stay to the sides as much as possible, uh, less traveled road. Oh, and I just called. I just rammed right into the side of that mountain. You do get you, you do uh, damage your truck. You, you have to go to the shop and get it repaired before it becomes capacitated. All right, you got out of there pretty pretty well. So uh, instead of taking the shortcut here, I'm going to uh, go around and give you a little look at the town, <laughs> little town here. I'm telling you, the visuals are, 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 are very cool. Little church up front there. The one thing I, I, I just get from this game is that it seems kind of apocalyptic, right? Like there's nobody around, there's no there's no cars driving around, there's no movement. It's, it just seems like a dead city. And you hear a dog, which kind of gives it that gloomy fallout feel. 
<laughs> I mean, it's pretty crazy. You see the there's just cars laying around. It's like it's like some kind of major catastrophic event happened, and this is what's left. So there's numerous amounts of vehicles in this game from official DLCs to the mod community making their own. So hopefully I'll be featuring a lot of different vehicles in this game. From pickup trucks to there's even a G-Wagon, some Land Rovers, rigs, some old school trucks, you know, uh, and, and a wide variety of trailers that you can use to uh, complete missions. So, uh, looking forward to trying a lot of those out. And then there's uh, there's there's different regions. You got Michigan, Alaska, uh, and a few others. But it, of course, you have to open them up, and you travel between. You know, you go to your garage and you travel to another garage in another region. So that's how you move around. And it's <laughs> bouncing along over here. I realize that in this game, all-wheel drive is, is gold. You got a vehicle where all-wheel drive, you're good. We're driving up here. Oh, I think I just went up the wrong way. So this is base camp here. And as you can see, there's a there's a truck there. <laughs> I just realized uh, I'm about to turn around and go back. I missed it, wrong, wrong driveway. some real uh, rustic living out here the trailers just mud everywhere so we're gonna turn here and go up the next the next right and that should bring us to the watchtower which will open up open up the map and give us some some missions to, to take on All right, so we're going up this hill right here. We're going up to the watchtower, and you can see it right above there. Uh, there we go. Oh! Oh my God! I think I just lost my whole front end right into the rocks, and she's still going. <laughs> Yo, straight nose dive. All right, let's see if this bad boy makes it up there. Here we go. Here we go. One last push. And we're over. We're up. We made it. There's the watchtower right here. This will open up the map. There it is. <laughs> I love this Mountain Men music. Alright, so. There's the watchtower. Now we can go back to where we were last, the truck, pick up that truck and knock out some missions. We'll head back down this hill again. Hopefully I could not smash into boulders. I love the detail, man, of the game, like the way the rocks kick up, the exhaust, just the, the accumulation of the dirt on the truck. It's, they paid, they paid, uh, paid attention to detail the little the little details the way that the dirt kicks up and everything looks pretty realistic now I'm playing in 2k I think this game is 4k capable so I can only imagine when you go higher so that over there looks like the lumber yard I wonder when that that'll come into play We're gonna go up to get this truck. I think it was further down right here up this driveway. Alright. I'm 
another thing I love about this game is that they use licensed trucks. They ain't like, you know, like made up trucks with made up, you know, uh, names. Like you're driving a GMC, you're driving a Chevy, you're driving Land Cruisers. I think there was, I think I saw even a G Wagon, uh, plenty of rigs. trying to figure out here i'm still trying to maneuver all the all the control settings and you just jump right into the truck <laughs> you teleport right into the new vehicle all right this is going to be interesting okay so we're going to head down the hill make our way towards town this is going to be one hell of a drive through this mud, and I think I might have not taken that turn early enough. <laughs> I'm just trying to avoid getting stuck. Oh, what am I doing? I'm just trying to avoid getting stuck in the mud. I haven't had I haven't had to use the the winch yet. Uh, I might have spoken too soon. Oh no, wait, wait, we're we're, we're out of it. Alright, so we're gonna head up into the back into that town and see what kind of missions we can pick up. Try not to knock down any trees. This bad boy's this bad boy's bouncing. Oh, oh. Oh. I like that. Strong air horn. apocalyptic town there's nobody to be seen I wonder if they're gonna add people at some point like you know just have like some people walking around or sitting on the porch or something man like some traffic all right so now we're gonna pick a mission here all right and we're gonna I guess we're gonna build the bridge so we need to get we need to get, to get metal beams, there you go, metal beams and lumber to the bridge. So, we're picking up the beams from this municipal spot here, coming up. Oh, I'm knocking over cones, and let's see how I take this turn here. Oh. Yeah, maneuvering these things ain't so easy on these tight roads. I'm trying to turn my view here, and I just can't seem to make it work. All right. All right, so we're, I'm just gonna try to turn here and not hit anything. Slowly, slowly, all right. Don't hit, don't hit the truck there. All right, here we are, loading up the beam, boom, all right, I think I got two, two loads, I could fit two loads in the bed, so I think we're good to go, and I'm still confused with the uh, controls here, I'm trying to get the hang of it. Okay. Uh, everything seems to be strapped in. Okay. You just need to get out of this menu here. There you go. on it. We're going to head down to the bridge. Make this 
turn here, and this should be a straight shot. You gotta be careful with the load, because this load, the truck can't tip over, the load can't fall out, and then you're pretty much have to start over again. Keep an eye on my fuel too, so I get stuck. And we're leaving town. Goodbye. It's very, very 70s. It's like this place is stuck. Stuck in time. Alright, so here's the. Coming up on the detour here. Alright. I'm trying to stay on the edge here. Because I figure a heavier load will definitely sink into the mud, so. Let me guess on it. Oh, 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 stay on, stay on, stay on. Get this. Good thing I strapped that thing down good. Alright, here we go. No problem there. Alright, now we gotta cross this little loop. Creek. All right. Cool. There we go. Oh no no no! Oh yeah, we did it. From wheel drive truck, I think. <laughs> All right. Now we're off to the bridge. Take an inside, inside look at the ca cabin here. And, uh, it's pretty old. <laughs> Still got to figure out how to use the tracker. Uh, the head tracker. I'm pretty sure you can use it. It's just got to figure out what settings you got to... You either got to enter VR mode or something like that. So I'll figure it out. We're gonna make a turn here. My man got the Mr. Rogers sweater on. All right. Here we are, we got the bridge. We're gonna drop off this uh, this metal. They're gonna start building. Looks pretty dangerous right there. Oh, 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 wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am, why am I backing up? Stop. Alright. <laughs> Let's try this again. Yeah. All right. Let's unload this bad boy. There you go, fellas. Oh, look at that. An erector set. Nice. Look at that. If only real construction would be that quick. All right. Now we're going to go with some lumber to finish this job up. So we're going to turn this bad boy around and uh, go get some wood. Oh. All right. Yeah. We definitely don't want to go forward. It looks like a good 100 foot drop. So we're gonna turn, all right. Oh, now I finally got this camera to move. Look at that view. Absolutely beautiful. All right, now we're gonna turn this camera around and back this bad boy up. This trip looks like it's got some stories to tell. Been through some, been through a lot. All right, don't hit the outhouse. <laughs> We're on our way to the lumber yard. Get some lumber. where we're at the watchtower. We're, oh, we're gonna, I missed my turn here. Oh, 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 am I gonna clear it? Oh no, gotta back it up, this is my turn. So this road right here is gonna take us down to the lumber yard, down by uh, where the watchtower was. And uh, we're gonna pick up our lumber shipment and uh, head back to the bridge and hopefully the crew will be ready to finish the bridge up. 
And that'll be the end of our very first mission on SnowRunner. And saw absolutely no snow. <laughs> I guess the snow come later once we uh, you head over to like the new new maps like in, in Alaska. I'm pretty sure there's plenty of snow there. So uh, looking forward to, to see what kind of missions are over there. So all right, so we're heading down to the lumberyard. This, this this road here is going to take us. And, uh, is that water up ahead? Seems like some fast moving water. Let's see how deep it is. We don't get pushed. Oh yeah, we got a little warning that it was deep water, but no match for my old truck here. This thing moves pretty good, man. It's bouncy, but it moves. Passing the house there. Pretty sure nobody's home. Yeah. Hiding from zombies. All right. Oh, which way am I going to go here? I'm going to turn here. Uh, maybe I should go here. Wait, what am I doing? I'm going to knock down a little baby tree. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, I'm running over bushes then. <laughs> All right, here we are. We're at the lumber yard. We're going to pick up some, some of the lumber and then make our way back to the bridge. Right? Call it a success. If I don't get stuck, look at all that wood here. I'm serious about the lumber out here. Alright, so it, in this game, it gives you options where you can do like a quick load or use a crane. Uh, we'll use a crane at some point. But we're gonna do a quick load for now. So I'll figure that out. So there's one, one load there. Let's add another one. Boom, two. We're good to go. Oh, wait, what happened? There you go. Took one away. Two, two loads. All right, here we go. We're gonna go out the front now. Let them get stuck. Bad boys are waiting there for us at the bridge, man. You know, want to keep them waiting, going overtime. Come over here to the side, avoid all this mud. Lumber on the truck. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh yeah, she's running good. Getting very good move. Oh, look at that. I like this. I like this view. Definitely got to get the head tracker so I can see more of the uh, more of the dash in the, uh, of the, uh, the cabin. Oh man, I'm I'm, zo I'm zipping right through here. Yeah, this mud is no 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 challenge for this truck. There you go. Here's the water. Oh, we're gonna rip right through here. Oh yes, right through. All right. Oh, there's the bounce. Slow it down over here. <laughs> that lumber will go flying right off. I can hear the I can hear the straps snapping. Here we go. Yeah. Alright, we're making it to the main road here. Let's keep it together, we're almost there. Oh, don't hit the rock, don't hit the rock. Alright. Uh, here we go, we're on the main road. We made it. We made it. Go, come on. You got it. You got it. You got it, big guy. All right. Here we go. Turn this bad boy. Turn the radius things. <laughs> Turn the radius on these things are atrocious. All right. Here we go. We're at the bridge. We're going to offload the lumber. And our first mission in SnowRunner will be complete. Didn't have to use the winch yet. And there it is, folks. The lumber's there. We're going to finish building this bridge. And I 
think we'll call it an episode of uh, very first episode of SnowRunner. There it is. There's the wood going down. Look at that. Look at that marksmanship. Boom. I have been promoted already. Sweet. Anyways, man, thanks for watching. I'll be bringing more SnowRunner content, man. If you got any questions, leave comments. You know, comment section below. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.